Today we launched Superbase Storage and I'm going to quickly show you how you can deploy an example app that we built on Vercel and Superbase in minutes. Come to superbase.io, scroll down to storage and click learn more. Once on the storage page, scroll down to the demo section and hit deploy. Once on Vercel, select your account, choose a project name and hit continue. Then we need to install the Superbase integration and deploy the user management starter. Choose your Superbase organization and hit continue and enter a project name and some secure password for your database. Choose your region and you're good to go. Once the Superbase backend is set up, you'll be returned to Vercel where you can hit continue to deploy the front end. From here, just select GitHub, choose your GitHub profile and a repository name, and then hit deploy. You can see that the environment variables for Superbase are already pre-filled. From here, just wait about 30 seconds for the front end to deploy to Vercel. And then once that's done, we can go ahead and check out our new project. Now the back end and the front end have both been deployed, we can visit the site. Now this is part of the Superbase storage demo. So you can enter your email here. Send yourself a magic link. I'll just drag up my mail and hit confirm. Now the purpose of this demo is to show you how easy it is to upload user profiles and link images and have the images connected to your users. So I'll type in my name here, put in my website and upload a profile picture. Once I'm done, I can click update and the image is now stored inside Superbase storage and linked to my user. If I navigate to app.superbase.io and open up my Superbase project storage test, look for the storage icon on the left hand side and you'll see the new storage UI. Now down the left hand side, I can see my avatars bucket which is where the image will, will have been uploaded to. And inside I'll find the image and the image preview. Now from here I can easily download, delete or copy the URL to my new profile image. You'll see on the left hand side that I can manage auth for all of the files stored in Superbase storage. And since we used an example project, you can see we already have some policies in place to allow public access to read from the avatars bucket. For a full guide on how to use storage, head over to superbase.io slash docs and take a look at the storage documentation. And if you have any questions at all, just email beta at superbase.com and we'll be there to answer your questions.